Hey guys, how's it going? Toby, welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. And today we have got a really awesome gold team. It's in the 433 formation, the third variant, and it cost me around 50,000 coins. And that's including the chemistry styles, which is absolutely awesome because it really does improve the team. Now, before we do get started and I start talking about all the players and things like that, if you're looking for a fantastically cheap and reliable place to pick up some ultimate team coins from, check the link in the description for the FIFA shop.co.uk, a really great website, especially if you're trying to open some packs to perhaps get some legends or just stock up for next gen. And if you use the code TOBY10, you get an even further discount of all of your orders. So let's move on to this team. And the defense is something I'm quite familiar with. I wanted to use the goalkeeper, centre back, right back, and centre defensive mid from the Syria, and it's something I'm used to because my Chetty was incredible last time I used him. So was Ogbonna and Abate. So was Marquisio. So I thought I'm going to try those those four again, and then I'm going to build a team completely different using players that I've never used before. So it's a big contrast, and it's really really cool. So I've mixed it up with some League One players and some BPL players just to give it a bit more of an interesting twist. And it's a really, really solid team, especially the defense. Man, the defense is so, so fast. And that's kind of what you need, really. You need them to be able to keep up with these strong attackers because I've noticed lately people are using a lot of BPL teams with Sturridge and players like Kone as well. They're very fast and you need some players that are going to keep up with them. So our defense, it works perfectly. It works really, really well. And the Matuidi is our other center defense mid. Center attacking mid is Valbuena. Now, I haven't used Valbuena yet, but I absolutely loved him on FIFA 13. He's so, so good. He's so quick at dribbling. And his acceleration was absolutely astronomical. Like, he was so fast. If you lofted through balls it to him, he would be off like an absolute rocket. Levetti, someone that I've always wanted to try, but he's around 30k and that kind of put me off. But I'll let you know if he's worth that. And then we've got Ben Arthur. The only problem with 5-star skills I have in this game is I always forget to do skills. Like, I'm always busy doing something else. And I completely forget I have a 5-star skill. So I think there's one reasonable skill goal in here, which I think I used one skill. And it wasn't even that good. I think it was just like the reverse flip-flap. But still, I used a 5-star skill. It's somewhere in there. And Remy is our striker. I've wanted to use Remy before because... He's so good on previous FIFAs. He's just ridiculously quick, decent at shooting, and four-star skills, which is really, really good. So if you get in a bit of a tight situation, you can wriggle your way out of it and try and maneuver around their defenders with the four-star skills. And I'm going to show you guys the chemistry styles that I have put on the players because, like I said at the start, I think it really, really does benefit the team. And if you don't do it already, these are the ones that I would recommend placing on the team now. As you can see, we got finish it on Remy. He's way, way, way too quick to even need like a Hunter card or Hawk card. You just don't need it. He's so quick. So improving his shooting and heading further is awesome. Maestro and Lavezzi was incredible. His passing was absolutely sublime, as was his shooting. Sniper on Ben Arthur. We've got Powerhouse on Marquisio. Sentinel on Matuidi. Just because I found Matuidi getting into really good shooting position. So I whacked out on him to give him better shooting. And then the rest you can see on screen. But let's talk about the gameplay and how the team performed now. I actually struggled with this team at first. And it might have been the formation. I haven't used a formation with wingers in literally ages. Like, it really has been a long, long time. And I did start to lose quite a few games at the start of each game and then have to make a bit of a comeback and get things going a bit because I don't know why but I really struggled at the start of quite a few games you'll see in the clips I might be a goal down and I try and equalize and I managed to which is awesome but I kind of don't want to have to do that because I know I can come back like most of the time I'm playing all right and I can make something happen like this game I was 2-0 down and I managed to win 5-3 in the end so I was tempted to quit because he scored two ridiculously annoying goals. But I'm glad I didn't because I managed to score a lot of goals without conceding any more. But I had such a terrible start. And that's what I found this team. It was weird, but it's a really, really good team. And to be honest, I think it was just me playing a little bit bad. So let me know how you guys find the team if you try it. Because on paper, it looks like an absolutely astonishing team. I think the only reason I had trouble was simply because I was playing a little bit bad. So let me know. Tweet me if you do enjoy the team. Like, if you make it, just tweet me some pictures or some words to say, you know, it was a really good team. I enjoyed it. Or if you didn't, let me know. I always like talking to you guys on Twitter. So follow me down below. There is a link in the description. But overall, it was a good team. I enjoyed it. And once I got used to it, 
I did manage to win a lot of my games. I think I played eight games with this team and I managed to win five of them and then lost or drew the other three, which isn't too bad. I'm going to give it an eight out of ten, which is pretty good. It's a really cool team for something that if you don't want to build like a starter team for around 25 or 10 to 25k ish, but you want something that's a little bit better with something like a star player in like Levetsi because he's our most expensive player. I think it's a really good team to go for, so let me know if you enjoy it, subscribe if you haven't already, and drop the video a like if you did enjoy it. But take care guys, have an amazing day, and goodbye.